T. Clark here with the 2019 AP Computer Science A FRQ. And question number one, A. Question one uh, has a calendar, AP calendar class containing methods used to calculate information about a calendar. So we're going to write two of them. At 1A, we're going to write the um, number of leap years. But we're going to use the method is leap year, which returns true or false depending on if it's leap year or not. Our task is to return the number of leap years between year one and year two inclusive. So I set it up over in my replit tab on the right. Let's look at the more solidified directions here. So it says to write the static method number of leap years, which returns the number of leap years between year one and year two inclusive. In order to calculate the value, a helper method is leap year with a year returns true if the year is a leap year and false otherwise. So we have to complete the method number of leap years and you must use leap year, is leap year. So I set it up with the header and the um, method signature. And I know I need to return an int. So because I'm returning an int, I'm going to set that up first. So int result equals 0. And then I'm going to return it at the bottom. So I'm going to, at the bottom of my page, I'd write, or I just add a bunch of enters, return result. That way I don't forget. So I set it up first thing. And then the second thing right away is I return it at the very bottom. So it looks like I'm going to tally up the number of years. So to tally them up, I want to loop. So I'm going to set up my for loop. And it's just be a normal for loop starting at year one and going to year two inclusive. So because it's inclusive, I have to include that equals to an I plus plus. So I'm starting at year one. And I'm going to and including year two. So that's the inclusiveness of it. So it has the equal to. And the precondition, I don't have to worry about the precondition. That just means the years are going to be valid. I don't personally have to do any checks. They'll be guaranteed to be OK. And it'll work as intended. OK, then I need to check and see if the current year is a leap year. So I just use that helper method, is leap year, and put in the year, which is i in this case. And then I just say result plus plus. And that's basically it. I'm just cleaning it up right now with all the tabbing weirdness going on. And then extra enters ahead. So I could have said year instead of I if I wanted to. So I could have said I, uh, year, year, year. Is this year a leap year? But that looks weird to me, so I'll keep it I. I just know that I is every next year. So that's the 2019 AP Computer Science A FRQ number 1A.